Happy birthday as well. You always find a lady's courtyard. An solution. Get out of the box. Hello and welcome to Radio Waves by Totterbert. If you enjoy reviews, comparisons, band scans of new and classic portable radios, then make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss any of my most excellent videos. In front of us we have the Sanjin PRD-17. This is an AM-FM stereo portable radio built to assist the visually impaired. Tonight I'm going to perform an evening medium wave band scan. First I'm going to go over features, second I'm going to do a size comparison, third I'll start cruising that evening band. So let's check it out. The Sanjin PRD-17 it is definitely for the visually impaired. It has high contrast colors. Uh, it has braille marked buttons. It has voice prompting, which you're going to get to hear. So let's get started on features. Left hand side, we have a FM stereo, FM mono jack here. Switch FM to stereo. Tells us when we do it. Switch FM to mono. Switch FM to stereo. Nice. Auxiliary in jack. Headphone jack, also has FM stereo there. DC input, 9 volts, 7 tenths of an amp. It comes with the AC adapter when you buy this. Now the radio runs about $78 on Amazon. Now the link's down below if you're interested in this radio. It's really cool. It's like a mix between a D15 because it has a built-in handle and the PRD5 because it doesn't have the 1 kilohertz tuning or bass treble control. But still, it's a great radio on medium wave. So we'll get to that in a little bit. Um, so here we have our two two and a half inch speakers. Nice stereo separation. Our LCD display right now is showing a 12 hour clock. You can change it to 24 hour clock. Uh, this device will also tell you the time. It is 10 55 p.m. So that's Central Standard Time. I'm near Chicago, Illinois. Gotta love that. It's like those talking watches. Yeah, talking radio. Loving it. Uh, so yeah, it'll show RDS information. Uh, I think it shows like the station name first and then radio text if it's available and that's it. That's all you get. There's no way to change that. Uh, here we have the low battery uh, indicator when that comes on. This radio actually tells us the battery level when we uh, check the time during when the radio is on. It's kind of cool. So we got our power button here. Uh, I'll have little symbols uh, imprinted on there. And as you use it, you'll get used to those symbols. Uh, if you can't uh, see them, I notice that some have like more of a rounded edge. It's they're not standard symbols you would see, uh, but uh, I think over time you'd get to know which ones are which. To the left here we have the band select. We have our menu. This is where you can change nine kilohertz, ten kilohertz tuning, um, some basic things like English, uh, Spanish prompting. Um, yeah, it's kind of neat there. Alarm set. We have our sleep setting. Of course, display I just showed you. Our one through five uh, preset, you only get five per band. So you get a total of 10 presets on the radio, which is kind of weak. I wish it had more. Um, if you look here, uh, anybody knows Braille, um, actually I was kind of educated on this. Uh, this is actually letters, A, B, C, D, E. The only way that you know that they're numbers is if it has that backwards L um, indicator before the first uh, dot there. So this would be an A without that designator. So if you're reading this in Braille, you're thinking these are A, B, C, D. It's just something to tell you. So let's go ahead and go to the right-hand side of the radio. We have the volume control, the tuning knob, which is clicky, and it's a push button. So it has push button seek, and it also has time set. So I press and hold that, the radio will let me set the time. And of course it tells, talks you through the time process. On top is that handle built in, like the D15, I love that. This is just a great thing to have. Uh, back here we have our FM antenna. This extends out to 27 inches, great for FM reception. And on the back here we have some information. Let's see if I can get this in the camera here for you guys. Uh, we have Sanjin PRD17, FM stereo RDS, and it says for the vision impaired. And you can see there you got the 9K, 10K uh, option and it runs on 6C batteries. And they're behind that compartment. I'm not gonna mess around opening that up. But just to let you know, 6C batteries, if you have a hard time seeing things, have somebody put those batteries in because that was one of the hardest things for me. And I can see what I'm doing. And yeah, it, it was hard to get those in there. So that's my one major gripe is these batteries are difficult to remove and replace. 
yeah. <laughs> if you own any of this style radio, the D15, the D5, they're all the same. They're a pain to change the batteries. I also recommend using alkalines. Rechargeables, they dump fast for some reason. <laughs> I was filming a daytime band scan, and I was at 70 when I started, and it ended at 30%, so I don't know what was going on there. So I threw some alkalines in for tonight. Um, so there you go. So get started here. So let's do a size comparison real quick. We got uh, CC Pocket in the house, showing the same time. Give you an idea for size here. It's a rather, yeah, this radio is quite large compared to these smaller radios. Here's CC Skywave, just give you an idea. And then we have a deck of cards handy. There you go. Iron Man, he's the man with the master plan. He can spin it, whoops, and fall off like no one can. <laughs> he loves Sanjin radios from California land, where their US based outpost is. <laughs> there you go, pretty cool, having fun with that. All right, so let's go ahead and turn this on, see how far we get in the evening band. I mean, I get through the whole band because there's a lot going on in the evening. Just to let you know, this radio incorporates a 200 millimeter internal ferrite antenna. It's a close to eight inches long. It's amazing, uh, pulling power. That antenna puts it in the league of the PRD5, the PRD15. And then moving to the C-Crane EP Pro, the C-Crane CC Radio 2E and 3, and the old school Panasonic RF2200 and GE Super Radios 1 and 2. I don't know about number 3 on GE Super Radios, if it has a 200 millimeter ferrite or not, but this thing was a beast during the day. I'm hoping it's the same during the evening. There's no auto-tuning to get you all messed up in the evenings. So I like that. So let's get going. Power on. AM band. 100% battery level. Nice. 100%. AM 520. So we're going to hear her announce every time I change the frequency. There's no way to turn that off. I have the volume turned down to 1 for voice prompting. It goes all the way to 5. So yeah. You'll have fun listening to that. Also note with a medium wave or the AM band, if you're new to radio, I actually have to turn the top of the radio towards the station I'm receiving. That's how that internal antenna works. It picks up the station best pointed towards the broadcasting station. And of course it works bi-directional. So if I'm pointing it to the west, where it is now, I can pick up stations to the east. AM 530. Okay, I'm not coming in tonight. Should definitely be able to pick this up. Okay, we'll go to the next station. AM 540. I think we might be picking up CBK Watros Saskatchewan here, which is 1,025 miles away. I'm going to bring a passive loop in just to see if it makes a difference. Trick advantage. Okay, so during the day, this works fantastic. In the evening, this radio is so sensitive um, that you don't really need to have that. So let's go ahead and turn the radio to the north and pick up our WAK station. No! So here you go, WAUK, Jackson, Wisconsin, 70 miles to the north, and it's 400 watts at night. WAUK, 540 AM. There you go. Choice for News Talk Radio. Streaming 24-7 at WAUKradio.com. Nice. AM 550. Warning from airline and air cargo CEOs. Hoping AT&T and Verizon. Here's KTRS, St. Louis, Missouri. 275 miles, 5,000 watts. CEOs sounding the alarm, saying in a letter, immediate... AM 560. Around the world as a volunteer with Feed My Starving Children. Now make it part of a meaningful career. So it's got a low tone to it, uh, typical of Sanjin radios. Uh, yeah, no bass trouble to change that. It does sound good when there's music on the AM band. I did notice it does brighten up a little bit. And it sounds great with FM stereo on the FM band. Um, I notice it brightens up. This is a local 560 WIND Chicago. That's where I'm at, by the way. Chicago, Illinois. And if you don't know what time it is, you just hit the button. It is 11 0 3 p.m. 100% battery level. The and down is beyond your That's control. That's how that works. But you're at a point in your life where you can't afford to make big financial mistakes. 
on. Now, and it goes back to showing frequency. Nice, well. nice. Our investment strategy allows you to go up with the stock market. AM 570. AM 580. So everyone needs an accurate thermometer. Try the Eastern Temple Scanner and learn more at estrogen.com. Should be WTCM, Traverse City, Michigan. 215 miles, 1100 watts to the east. AM 590. WKZO, Kalamazoo, Michigan, about 137 miles, 5000 watts, again to the east. Oh, wait, no, this is something else. Okay. This is KXSP, Omaha, Nebraska, which is southwest. 405 miles, 5,000 watts. Yeah, sports talk. AM 600. These stations are coming in kind of weak. We'll get some better stations. Okay, should be WMT, Cedar Rapids, Iowa, 175 miles, 5,000 watts. AM 610. Hold on to the football that long in the end zone. I get he wants to make a play, but you can't do it because what happens is the pass rush gets to him and he's going down. He doesn't want to take a safety. So, so yeah, sometimes you can move the radio to check and if it gets better towards that direction, you kind of gives you an idea what city you're pointing it towards. And this is pointing towards Kansas City, Missouri. This is KCSP. And this is 400 miles, again, southwest, 5,000 watts. Now, while the Cardinals were looking for some kind of... AM 620. WTMJ, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, 52 miles. Live from the headquarters of Ramsey. So AM 630. <laughs> okay, I think we have mixing going on. Hold on. Okay, religious station here on 630 is KYFI, St. Louis, Missouri, 275 miles, 5,000 watts, to the south. And this way is usually country music, but we're not picking up CFCO. Sometimes they'll mix. Cool. AM Sounds good. I don't know if that's coming through there. Hopefully it is. WMFN, Piatone, Illinois, 75 miles away, 1600 watts. Hispanic music, of course. AM 650. There we go. We got some country music on WSM, Nashville, Tennessee, 434 miles to the south. Lord, I bet you sing things in AM six six zero. Outside of that, I really don't have a rooting interest. Honestly, you know, without WFAN, uh, home of the Yankees, New York, New York, seven hundred fifty miles. I don't really care. I think the Bengals would be fun. And it's uh, coming in nice because right next to it's a real strong Chicago station, which is 670. We'll do that right now. 670. Man, because he's like the only guy that knows more than me about Chicago sports because I... WSCR, Chicago, home of the Cubs. About Chicago sports and grab... Memory 2. Like always would... Recall the preset to AM 670. Like, like, grab knowing about living, breathing. AM 680. AM 
1960. Sounds like we have some old time radio. Maybe on CKGM? That's interesting. Montreal, Quebec, 763 miles. Yeah, it's 11 o'clock. Nice. AM 700. Department of Labor and the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau will form a truck leasing task force that will review leasing arrangements to identify... WLW, Cincinnati, Ohio, with the Trucker News, which is neat. It's I think they pride themselves on being a trucker-related station. I had to get school because my father was a over-the-road trucker. All right, this is uh, 300 miles. Cincinnati, Ohio. I don't know if I mentioned that. To the east. Oh, it sounds like a local at night. AM 710. This is not related to the Jews, right? Hold on. during her trial so here's WOR 710, uh, New York, New York, 750 miles. Next to a strong local. AM 720. On VJ, and as soon as I started it, I thought to myself, well, if Scotty doesn't call, then he's not listening, because I know. They got the hall effect going on there. Uh, 720 WGN Chicago. Hello, Roddy. How you doing? All right. How about yourself? All right. That's Gary's own Spaniards. AM 730. A oh, tough night for some of these Canadian stations. This is usually a CKDM over here. Let's see if we can get the Zuma radio. AM 740. We can always get Zuma radio, right, guys? CFZM, Zuma radio. Toronto, Ontario, 460 miles. Nice to the northeast. That's good. Seven five zero. Called me about voting. You never called me about even Bill back better. Not that he would have signed off on it. So here's seven fifty. WSB year. Atlanta Georgia six hundred and thirty miles. A bad week. I mean, people are seven percent poorer now because of Biden inflation. AM seven six zero. It is usually great. You should both group with Pakistani Prime Minister Yusuf Gaza Gilani once referred to Siddiqui as daughter of the nation. WGR Detroit, Michigan, two hundred and seventy miles. Tied charitable on convoy to Syria. AM seven seven zero. And in one second I'm going to Judy in uh, Westchester. See, we're close to 780. That's why we're getting that choppy sound to it. Uh, this is WABC, New York, New York, 750 miles. Um, yeah, if I had one kilohertz tuning, I could back it up to like 768 kilohertz. And get rid of that. So we'll go to 780. Here's WBBM Chicago. They have old-time radio tonight, uh, 12 a.m. to 1 a.m., Monday through Friday, uh, which is nice. If you can pick up 780 WBBM in your area. He talks about the emotional value of his microphone with words. It was the microphone that I toured with for AM 790. AM 800. Some country music there <clears throat> on 800. I don't think that's CKLW, but uh, usually this is CKLW. Usually it's news. Windsor, Ontario, 270 miles. That's the direction to that northeast. I'm getting country music, so I'll check, and if I can find something, I'll put it up here. I'll put a pop up if I can find something for the station. Ah, so the point is it right? Okay, so that's interesting. The northwest or uh, yeah, southeast comes in clear. Good way to check it. WGY, Albany, New York, 740 miles. 
AM 820. People millions of dollars. We'd rather pass that value on to you. WBAP. 900, 8,000. And speak with one of our experts. We'll send you a free gold kit along with my latest... Fort Worth, Texas, 810 miles. ...selling book, The Great Devaluation. Call 800-900-8000. That's 800-900-8000. Get the best information, the best process, the best service, the best value. Call Advantage Gold at 800-900-8000. Call 800 800- Waiting for maybe call letters. Bring the image and brand of our radio stations to life as the promotions director for the Cumulus Media Dallas Music Station. If your experience as a marketing or promotions director can plan major events, create content like promotions... Here you go, Hershey, Dallas. ...and you understand and can execute brand management... Okay, we're going to keep going. 830. WCCO, Minneapolis, Minnesota, 310 miles. AM 840. of them, seeing them as prophetic, epic, miraculous, just to name a few overused adjectives. Um, 840 to be HAS, Louisville, Kentucky. I keep saying the frequency is showing it and saying it, and I'm saying it again. <laughs> so you'll know what's ingrained in your head. Louisville, Kentucky, ground zero right now, uh, coast to coast in the evenings. We don't expect these bad things. AM 850. I think it would have naturally happened in our civilization that women would continue to... So here's KOA, Denver, Colorado, 890 miles. But you had Gloria Steinem, who if you go on YouTube, you can see the interview. AM 860. France, the first culinary edition of the culinary remonte in the years 50. It was a large... CJBC, Toronto, Ontario, 460 miles, our French speaker. CRACS, pardon. Et 20 ans plus tard, dans les années 70, on a pu voir la cuisine des mousquetaires qui était menée par l'incontournable Maïté Ordonnée. AM 870. We're going to catch an ass whooping like this. So Matthew Stafford, I guess for one game, he shakes 870 WWL, New Orleans, Louisiana. For one night, 865 miles Matthew to the south. Stafford Straight is south. worth the money and worth the trade that Los Angeles pulled off to bring him in from Detroit. And AM 880. A cold case team, including a retired FBI agent and around 20 historians, criminologists, WCBS. and specialists, called through evidence New York, for New five York. years to try to uncover who betrayed Anne Frank and her family. The team says it may have been a prominent Jewish notary named Arnold Vandenberg who disclosed the hiding place of the Frank family to German occupiers in order to save his own family from deportation to Nazi concentration camps. The Anne Frank Museum says it welcomes the research, but many questions have been left unanswered. A new test could diagnose autism through hair samples. AM 890. Here's 890 WLS Chicago you're refinancing your existing home, then you need to call Team Hochberg, your trusted local lender. Susan, a little high-pitched wine coming from the camera. But not too bad. Usually it's louder on most radios. To refinance her ex-husband offer... AM 900. Okay, I'm going to go a little quicker now. It's running out of time. So I'm going to... Well, seek tuning in at night's not as good. Seek up. AM 910. It's going to stop on everything. Detroit, Michigan, WFDF, 270 miles, 25,000 watts. AM 920. I'm just going to go up to some stations I know. AM 990. A little bit of bleed over from 1,000, it sounds like. This is 990. CBW, Winnipeg, Manitoba, 675 miles. In her book, How to Change, behavioral scientist Katie Milton. AM 1000. By Get Covered America and the Ad Council. Whoa! So here's the uh, WMVP Chicago. Find yours at discovertheforest.org. Learn about forest. AM 1010. AM 1020. You gotta be here tomorrow because there's another agency trying to. KDKA, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, 450 miles. AM 
WBZ, Boston, Massachusetts, 880 miles. It looks like the west gap got even wider during this global pandemic. Here's CBS Vicky Barker. AM 1040. Of course, with medium wave, it gets better as time goes on sometimes in the evening, or worse. This is WHO, Des Moines, Iowa, 280 miles to my west. I felt like I had an out-of-body experience. I couldn't believe I pulled it off. AM, AM, one, zero, six, zero. One of their weekly shifts. Matt Bigler for CBS News, Oakland, California. Now the KYW Sports Scoreboard, the Sixers lost. So they announced KYW. This is Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, 700 miles from my location. And 16 rebounds. Maybe a little quicker here. AM, AM, 1090. Our minor home improvement with a major impact. Here's 1090. This is KAY, Little Rock, Arkansas, to the south, 570 miles. Discounts on premium blind shade shutters and more. AM one one zero zero. This is a crazy thing that we're going through. WTAM Cleveland, Ohio, three hundred and forty five miles. Usually comes in like a local. They may be having a storm to the south southeast. Well, you're talking about the stages of a dating, but at one point too you talked better. about the fact that you had lost your wife. AM one 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 zero. AM one one two zero. An FDA cleared scientifically proven non invasive procedure. There's KMOX St. Louis, Missouri, two hundred and seventy five miles. Increase blood flow, stimulate stem cells. AM one one three zero. AM one one four zero. Right, it's just I miss her so much, so deep inside. I started dating. Here's eleven forty to be R V A Richmond, Virginia, six hundred and sixty five miles. In the beginning. I mean just and, and see I've been through this many times. I told you my father was found dead in the trunk of his car. AM one one five zero. AM AM one one eight zero. The first shows that we did because I would talk to you, Vicky. You would you would say one word. <laughs> Here's Wham W H A M Rochester, New York, five hundred and forty five miles. Like, what? Okay, shut you up. Going a little faster now. AM AM one two one zero. Oh, hi Frank. Howdy George. Glad to be back with you. Sixties. I was brought up in the sixties. Here's W P H D Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, seven hundred miles. A question about AM one two two zero. AM one two three. I'm gonna go up now really quick. Because I don't want to hear that prompt every time, but there's no way to turn that off. Three zero zero. Mm, I'm thinking this is local. 1300. Power down. Okay, let's go to 1510. It's missing a lot, but there's a lot here. If you want to know? This is WMBD Peoria, Illinois, 135 miles, 5,000 watts. Natural Health in Morton. AM one five one zero. To make the Department of Defense run better and make those recommendations to the Secretary of Defense. Uh, uh, WLAC Nashville, Tennessee, four hundred thirty-four miles. AM one five two zero. And that's exactly what what Hitler did. Uh, Here's KOKC Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, six hundred ninety miles. PhD in history. Okay, I'm not an academic. AM one five three zero. Uh, one of them. Right. Unbelievable play. You steal seven, and on the net, very next. WCKY is Cincinnati, Ohio, three hundred miles. AM one five four zero. Great program, of course. Uh, that uh, obviously the theme uh, to the old Mary Tyler Moore show, where Betty. White... Here's KXEL, Waterloo, Iowa, two hundred and ten miles. Anyways, and what was sort of, I suppose, uh, let's go up to 1610. AM, AM 
a.m. a.m. 1610. CHHA Toronto, Ontario. Some Hispanic music? Nice. AM AM one six three zero. Usually it sometimes this comes in clear as KCJJ, Iowa City, Iowa. Let's go up to seventeen hundred and then we'll call it. AM AM one seven zero zero. Sports talk is KBGG, Des Moines, Iowa, two hundred and eighty miles. It'll probably improve. There's some Hispanic music I can just hear behind, which is KKLF Richardson, Texas, 790 miles to the southwest. There you go. So let's go ahead and turn this off. Power off. 100% battery level. Yay, 100% battery level. Nice. So there it is. The Sanjin PRD17 during the evening. Does a fantastic job. Uh, some of the stations weren't coming as clear, but I think it's just weather related or evening related. It, like I said, it improves. You heard if you wait long enough, the stations do come in nicer. Um, so yeah, overall, love this radio. Like I said, I have links below if you're interested in buying it. And like I said, it runs around $70, $78. Uh, if you need something like this, this is perfect. Uh, I'm glad they offer a radio like this, to be honest with you. Though it could use some improvements like bass treble controls, one kilohertz tuning, the ability to turn off voice prompts and just maybe have it like you do with the clock, where you just hit the clock button and it tells you the clock time. And then maybe you just have the same button or similar button next to it and you hit it and it tells you the frequency you're on instead of telling you every time you change it. Um, that would also be nice. I would That would be perfect. Just turn off the automatic voice prompting and have manual voice prompting. That would be a great idea. So just ideas I'm thinking about. Uh, two, if you enjoy Sanjin radios and want to see more, subscribe at the bell icon. Of course, you guys know that. And three, comment below what you think about the PRD17. Are you in a market for something like this? And if you are, let me know why. And uh, if you think you would really enjoy having this radio. Okay, guys, take care and we'll see you in my next video.